Let me pose an economic question. Mm -hmm. Does it cost more to see a naturopathic doctor than a medical doctor? Mm. That's a, it's a very tough comparison to make. Uh, most people don't realize the costs that are involved in seeing a medical doctor. They mm. go, so I hand their insurance card and say a $10, $20 copay. Uh, so that's all they pay and they don't know actually what the insurance company is paying the, the medical doctor. However, people without insurance know this very well, mm. that it is very costly to pay a medical doctor, and for good reason. I mean, they go to many years of school, have many costs, a lot of overhead to mm -hmm. run a facility. Um, so it really depends, one, on the state you live in. In some states, uh, naturopaths are licensed physicians and can take insurance. So insurance, uh, your cost would be similar to cost of going to a, a medical doctor as far as office visits go. Mm -hmm. Now things like supplements are not and uh, supplements are not covered by insurance. And those can range anywhere from, you know, five dollars to a hundred dollars mm -hmm. for your supplement costs. Um, naturopathic doctors in uh, states where insurance doesn't cover them, their costs tend to be similar to what an MD would charge if they didn't uh -huh. if a person didn't have insurance. And um, so that's the immediate cost. Now the other thing to look at would be long-term costs. Uh, the more you have to spend time in a hospital, mm -hmm. the more your bills are going to be. And even if insurance covers it, it all comes around because your premiums will go up the more they have to pay out for you. And so I feel like in the long term, naturopathic medicine eventually saves people money. Even if there is a cost up front, say if insurance doesn't cover it, because we're teaching methods of health. We're, we're teaching people how to be healthy, and most people then don't get the conditions down the road that are going to cause them to spend a lot of money. Mm -hmm. One night in the hospital can, you know, right. tank your life savings <laughs> pretty quickly. And uh, so, yes, there's an initial startup fee of, you know, perhaps an office visit. Um, some of the labs we order are covered by insurance, mm -hmm. and, and some of them aren't. And, and that goes for any doctors. And uh, again, people don't realize how much do labs cost. A doctor orders a whole slew of them, and insurance may pick it up. But if they were to pay for those out of pocket, it could be a pretty hefty bill. And so, um, and so that's a, an issue with cost as well. But in the long run, uh, despite having to pay for supplemental costs, despite maybe having to pay a little more money for some organic foods versus non-organic foods, or you know whatever. Mm -hmm. uh, in the long run, usually people save money because they're healthier, and you don't get as many conditions that cost a lot of money. And happier. Happier, <laughs> yes. They feel better. They like living more, and that is—it's uh, hard to put a price tag on that. Thank you.